Marketing your business can be very overwhelming, especially if you're just starting out and you don't have the funds to get a marketing team or simply pay for adverts. So in this video, I'm going to share with you guys some ways in which you can market your business with no money. So if that's something you're interested in, please make sure you keep watching the video till the end. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Anastasia, and if this is your first time stopping by, please make sure you hit the subscribe button and turn on your post notifications so that YouTube will notify you whenever I upload a new video. And also, if you find value in this video, please make sure you give me a thumbs up and yeah, let's get into the video. I've put together six ways in which you can market your business if you have no money to pay for marketing and all of that stuff. The first way you can market your business having no money is social media marketing. So what you want to do is get on the various social media platforms that will work for you and your business register your account is always free like i'll mention on um, instagram facebook there's twitter the snapchat chat there's snap <coughs> that just shows i don't even use the app there's snapchat yeah you can use all of those social media platforms to market your business with Instagram, you want to make use of the hashtags. So Instagram allows about 30 hashtags per post. So you want to make sure you use your hashtags. Make sure not to use the hashtags that are very popular. Use um, those that are not very popular so that you get a chance of people finding you when they click on that hashtag. You might try to blend a mixture of the popular hashtags and the less popular hashtags so that you increase your chances of um, your target audience finding you use the right tag so that the people that are interested in your business can easily find you and also on your page you want to make sure you're showing a variety like you post videos or maybe the product um, videos how to use it you can also post like photos and just like make sure your post has a variety when people stop by they are able to find um, the page attractive and helpful when it comes to facebook there are a lot of facebook groups like make use of facebook groups whatever your niche is just search you're going to find a lot of groups that cater to your niche so you join those groups and you make sure you contribute value to the group before you go ahead and start advertising and one thing you have to note is that most of these facebook groups they always have like <clears throat> group rules that you have to follow so you want to make sure that you follow the group rules so that you are not kicked out of the group because if they say you're supposed to post only on friday and you wake up and post on monday like they might warn you and if you keep doing that they might kick you out of the group so you don't want to be kicked out of the group so make sure that you follow the group rules and yeah contribute value to the group and then when it's time to promote your products or yeah people remember you and who knows you might get sales from that so that is also free you do not have to pay so yeah that's another free way of marketing your products there are a lot of these social media platforms that you just need to get on there create your account and start posting your photos of the products you sell or the services social media marketing these days is very effective so these days a lot of people are always on their phones on social media platforms so before they even get to a store to buy they must have even seen the stuff online like people are too into social media so you as a business you want to make use of that so yeah another way in which you can promote your business without having to spend any money is to offer giveaways and discounts so yeah this is a great way to get customers attention to your business and when you do giveaways who doesn't like free things like people like free products so when you do a giveaway and most of the times those giveaway rules will include um, maybe the person liking that post and tagging three of their friends so imagine 20 people responding to that giveaway they tag three of their friends each and that's a good amount of new people that could possibly see your products or your posts and they might find it interesting if you have interesting stuff so yeah you want to make sure that you do giveaways once in a while like when it comes to like festive periods like christmas new year mother's day father's day all of that just do like father's day giveaway mother's day giveaway or christmas giveaway or thanksgiving giveaway like just do something 
when it also comes to discount you can include free shipping like just give a discount or you offer free shipping people like that people like free stuff so that's a great way to bring in the customers or to um, get the customers attention like when people hear free stuff they're all ears like okay what's this all about so that way they get to know more about your business moving on another point i want to mention is making use of micro influencers or like the small influencers so micro influencers are influencers that do not have a very large following they could have like 1000 so people even 300 that's a good number of people. Micro influencers would normally accept free products. You do not have to pay them a fee. They'll normally accept free products. So you can make a deal with them where you send them free products and then they use the product and review it to their audience to see. So that's a great way of reaching out to the audience of that small influencer to help you reach a wider audience and people can actually see how your product is being used and how it works for them. The next point I'm going to share is closely linked to like micro influencers and that is um, make use of your friends and family like ask them to help promote your products on their various platforms like for me I could just give like my family members a poster that I've made with all the information that they need to post like you should try to make things easier for them just type out whatever you want them to post and the photo and everything and you send it to them they're just going to go ahead and post it on their social media platforms you can also send them free products to try just like you do with the micro influencers you can send your family members or your friends free products for them to try and then post it on their stories or their feed on their various social media platforms that's another great way of getting your business out there without spending any money this next point should be common sense but common sense like they say it's never common so the next point i'm going to share is that you should have a great customer service like quick response quick delivery politeness and all of that stuff when you have a good customer service you're obviously going to have satisfied clients and satisfied clients always tell their friends about you so if people have like bad experience with you they'll never want to recommend anybody else just make them have a great experience that way you're going to even attract more customers Finally, apart from having a great customer service, you also want to make sure that your products are great. Make sure your products do what they say they can do. That way you have free marketing. Like imagine somebody having dark spots on their face and maybe you're making skincare products and they get these products and use it. And people that used to know them with dark spots all over their face will be like, wow, what happened to your face? And they're like, oh, I use this product. So if somebody else that she knows or he or she knows is suffering from that same thing they are obviously going to come over and get the same product because they believe in the effects of the product so yeah what i'm just trying to say is apart from making sure you have great customer service make sure that your products do what they say they can do and so those are the ways that you can promote your business without having to spend a lot of money or paying for adverts and all of that because as a small business you usually don't have that kind of money to start paying for adverts so yeah all these six ways i've shared with you social media marketing offer discounts giveaways make use of micro influencers ask your friends and families to help advertise your business for you on their various social media platforms make sure you have great customer service and also make sure that the product does what it says it can do that way you can get free marketing because like i said satisfied clients will always recommend your products and people like to see results so once they see results of the product obviously they're going to be won over thank you guys for watching that's the end of this video i hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you in my next video one more thing before you go please subscribe to my channel below and turn on post notification to support my channel and also give this video a thumbs up i appreciate all your love and support if you want to check my other business videos or business related videos you can check them in the link below i'm going to leave a link to the playlist so you can check them all out and yeah thank you guys again so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye